hello guys welcome to the service now world and today we'll see how to configure field style in service now field styles basically it's like uh, we have to apply how to con we'll see today like uh, how to apply css style in different form fields so for implementing this we'll take one use case today and use case is in an incident form make the color changes for priority as below like for priority 1 we have to make it red for priority 2 we have to make it yellow and for priority 3 we have to make it green for priority 4 we, uh, that is blue and for priority 5 that is gray so let's go to the instance and try to implement it so now we are in our uh, service now developer instance so it's a, like pdi so as usual firstly we have to check what is the existing configuration so we'll go to the incident here and if you see here for priority one already color is set so let's group by priority here So for priority 1, that's critical for red is already set, right? Let's see for priority 2, yellow is also set for priority 3. So we'll see that like uh, what we have seen like red is already set and this one yellow is also set for P2. For P3, no color is set, right? So for P3, what we need to set? We need to set it green right so how we have to uh, how how we'll set it so we have to firstly open one of the incident so there is two ways firstly we, or we can search it from here like field style and then we go to the field style here and then we'll create the style and then then we create the styling here by cl clicking on new right that is this is the one way Another way is that like you have to just open the uh, form and in which whichever the field you want to apply the styling just right click on that and you just click on configure styling. You see that already two styles are there so I'll just click on new and here I will select values 3 because I want to apply in a priority 3 and what is the color so I want to apply the background color so the attribute will be like background hyphen color colon green right and semicolon and just save it so this is the CSS property back background heaven color. Yes. So this is done. Now let me open the one duplicate tab here. And let's validate it. Like we have set the for priority three in an incident for uh, in incident table. The background color will be the green. So I'm just hitting here incident dot list. okay yes and you see that like that green background green color got applied it here right see so if we group by priority this time you see that for p3 green is coming previously it's not there for p1 red is already there for p2 yellow is already there and now for p3 already green will be, we have set the green now for p4 so currently if you see for p4 also no color is set so we'll set it here blue so how we'll need to set it as usual you just just go to here just click open that form okay whichever the field you want to set it the color just right click on that and just click on configure style So currently we have set for 
P3, P1, P2 already set. So we P3 we set it. Just click on new. And this time you'll select the value four. All right. Background hyphen color colon and that will be the blue, right? Yes. And then save it. And let's see. We'll update this. Currently, if you see, like there is no for P4, there is uh, no background color in the priority field. And let me refresh it. And you see that like blue color got set. Okay, so if you know the color, just write it here. And if you don't know the color name, just put the the, the hex code of that uh, color. So that will be also work. So let's say let's set for the P5 as well, gray color, right? So I'll just here write as five, and here I'll just write gray. And just click on insert and stay. So let me refresh it. So the thing is that already gray color is set it, but uh, we can't identify it here, right? So what we'll do, we'll sub change it to some different. Uh, instead of gray, we'll just write. We'll just take uh, any other color. Uh, whatever color will. We'll see let's see we'll set let's set tomato color so we'll just save it and if i refresh this time you will see tomato right this color is red and this is tomato or you can set whatever color you want so like that we have to set the background color apart from background color what we can set it so, so the thing is that like uh, i have told you about the background color right so that will be applicable you can configure the styling for these fields but what about the general fields currently if you see for the general fields it's a uh, coming as a uh, yellow color right but you want to change it to something else like green, blue, white, red, whatever, right? So how we can set it here? So in that case, you can't write right, right, right click here and call, click on configure style. It, it won't work. So for that, what you need to do, there are one properties there. Sys underscore properties dot list, right? And here, you just need to and here you need to search glide dot ui dot activity underscore stream dot style and if you want to change for the comments then you have to write comments if you change for work notes then you can write work notes so currently i want to change for comments so currently comments is showing as transparent right so let's see this one right let me click on so you see that no color is showing in comments right so let me set it as a green instead of transparent and i'll just update update this property And if I refresh this form, you see that like for additional comments, green is set, green color is set, right? So like that we have to do. Okay. And, and if you set for the work notes, so what do you need to do? You just to instead of you have to till this you have to kept it same and instead of comments you need to write the uh, work underscore notes so let me show you uh, 
and here I'll paste it and instead of comments I'll write work underscore notes if you see here currently it's showing as gold because this is the gold color and instead of gold if you want to make it red so you see that like after saving this our work notes background color changes to the red you see that right so i hope you got it and if you have any doubt please write in the comment box till that time thank you god bless you all